from the Hollers and Hills of West Virginia, it's Heavenly Hills Homestead with another episode. So stay tuned. Boom! on doing it it's every day i don't know what they're looking for or what they're doing it's weird this old girl here is a rock i mean there's no <laughs> there's no uh no uh, hollow sound. There's no, uh, what do you call it? Uh, echo inside of that thing. It's just thump, thump, thump. Listen to that. I bet you that up there is thick as all get out right here. She's a big old gal. If she keeps doing like she is, I'm liable to hit. <sighs> I don't want to say, because every time I say something, I end up eating crow, but if she keeps pushing like this, she'll she'll be good on the scale. Let's put it that. I'll, I'll be in the money if she keeps pushing like this. So. Jaden finally covered his uh, up right there. Need to get a weight on that one. And Annie needs to cover hers up. I don't know how much good it'll do them now. That season's pretty much over with. But, hey, who knows? You never know, right? You could come up with a, could come up with an upset or something, right? So. <laughs> See how it's looking anyhow. She's not been down here to check it. Woo! Man, I don't know. She might be done. Split all the way around. Yep, she may be done. Ooh, ooh, yeah. She's going to clean that rascal out. Let me go get her. Get a better look back here at it. Before she gets back here cleaning on it, you can see what's weird is this is the exact same side that this pumpkin went down on last year. This is the 950 cook, and this is the exact side. It was the left-hand side that it went bad on last year right here in this area the low bottom part of that area right there i mean she she sounds thick so i don't know but i mean you just i don't know she may she may be done so if it is i hope that's not the case because i wanted to i wanted to take one little way off but she may be done that's kind of what happens when you don't have much attention span on them so it's a nice little pumpkin though real nice it's got a good shape and 
would have had a really nice color to it. It's a 2261 Schmidt. Uh, it's a 1378 new cross to the 2261 Schmidt. So should have been a really rock, rock and seed, but uh, you know, um, I don't know. Things happen. But I did cross this to the 1088 Bayou, so that should be some pretty good stuff in it next year. So get her down here and get her cleaning this up, and on to the next. All right, honey. So what'd you do here? Oh, they cut a big chunk out. <laughs> you sure did. Goodness, is it all gone? Uh, most, most of I it. Think. Might have to clean out some more tomorrow. I don't want to scrape too much tonight. I don't think. Maybe we'll, we'll let it hit. Uh, get a fan on it there. Yeah, I need to put a fan on it and spray in some stuff on it. Keep everything. Is that the only it? bad spot you had, or? Um, there's a little bit right here. With oh, a little. Yeah. I picked out a little bit. It wasn't really as bad as it, I thought it was. Yeah. But. Right there, you look like you did a little something there, too. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if that's too bad either. All right. Well, I'll round you up a fan. You can put it on there. See if we can't get this thing to stay growing. I hope you can. <laughs> hope you can. I'm going to see you take window away off anyhow. All right, old boy. What you got there, huh? Big pumpkin. How much is she? Four hundred. And going to five hundred. Good. She's four hundred thirty-six pounds. She's looking pretty good. Looking pretty good. And I don't think you're at dat fifty yet. So. What fifty? Day after pollination. I don't think you're. At, I don't think you're dat fifty yet. So. <clears throat> She's looking pretty good. Doing pretty good. Mommy's is. Uh, we haven't measured it, so I need to go over and measure it real quick. I guess, but. That's a good looking pumpkin. Good looking pumpkin. Thank you. It's a lot bigger when I put it on regular. I had to zoom out and to get everybody in the picture, but it's a it's a big old gal. Nice and orange too. She's nice and orange, yes sir she is. What's going on here? She's looking alright. This one might wear the Howard Dale. I don't know, buddy. If it she's, gets any more. she's pretty. She's pretty scarred. You let the leaves oh. brush up on her too much. The leaves did that. Yep. I thought those. No, when it's a baby. Remember, I told you when it's that little old yellow baby. Yeah. Need to clear the leaves away from it. All these little sharp, stickly things right here on the leaves. They scratch. They make little scratches on the little baby pumpkin when the skin's soft, so, and then those turn into great big scars. So. That's how those happen. Yeah, I mean, you might you might be able to get a, a Howard Deal award with it. I mean, you might be able to. Um, I just have to get it. You know, it just depends on where you take it. It might be the orangest and the prettiest pumpkin there. So maybe you might get a Howard Deal for it. You just gotta see where where you're going to take it to, and uh, hope there's no other really orange ones there that are prettier. <laughs> so, she looks good, though. I'm proud of you. You're doing good. All right, cover her up. Oh, look, mommy finally put a cover on hers. So, all right, doing good. Elmer's here. What's up, Elmer? Did you come to work? Yeah. Yeah? Say, whoo, old dude. Oh, dude. Yeah, say, whoo, ain't working. <laughs> say, whoo, ain't working. You're not working? Okay. <laughs> Why don't you want to work? Because <laughs> don't want to. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Give me a pound, Elmer. All right. What's your name? Elmer. Elmer? <laughs> it's Elmer. Hmm. <laughs> Say, cool, dude. How about it, Say, cool, dude. Do the arm. Ooh, old dude. <laughs> yeah, cool, dude. There you go. There you go. You got it. Oh, man. We got T Wayne out here. What are you doing, T Wayne? Good. Say, I ain't doing nothing. I ain't doing nothing. There you go. <laughs> we got Elmer and T Wayne here. 
Elmer. Yeah, you're Elmer. And I'm T-Wayne. Yeah, and you're T-Wayne. So, <laughs> who, what's for breakfast? What's for breakfast? Yeah, there you go. So, who, Ma ain't cooked in a month of Sundays. I love it. Say, Ma, Ma ain't cooked in a month of Sundays. <laughs> you can do it. Say, whoo, old dude. Oh, dude. Gotta do the fingers. Whoo, old dude. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. <laughs> and, you, and I can be old. All right, I gotta go. I gotta get back to fertilizing. Y'all's cute. That's funny. That rascal right there, for being no better than the plant is, kind of surprising. It's even on there, to be honest with you. All this garbage down here is trashed. But potatoes, on the other hand, I was down here a couple of days ago. And nothing really looked too good. But there's a potato we just pulled today. It looks like it's been getting ate on by something, which is not good. Dug it up right, it was kind of just sitting there on the top. Or I'd rip some stuff out. So I'm gonna give these a few more days. And I'm gonna try to dig a little bit and see what they're like. And if they're any good, I'll dig them. If they're this size or bigger, I'll probably dig them and leave a few in there. It was just an experiment anyhow. So pretty good experiment. What y'all doing, huh? What you doing? What you doing, piggy piggies? Piggy 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 piggies. What you doing? Huh? What's everybody doing? Huh? Yeah, yeah. What y'all doing? What are you doing, Petunia? Oh, Petunia. Oh, Petunia. Yeah. Tell me, girl. Tell me all about it. You want some tater? I tell you what's the truth. Oh, Daddy will give you some more tater. Yeah, he will. Daddy will give you a piece of tater. Yeah, I know. I know. I ain't just horrible. Yeah. I think tomorrow... When we get back from the farmer's market, Daddy's gonna get in there and clean y'all's pens out since it ain't rained for a good three or four days. It's rained, but it ain't been torrential downpours, so it's trying to dry up some. Here you go, baby. Come on, there's a good girl. That's a good girl. Don't you take it, Wil Wilbur. I got you some here. Wilbur. Come on, Wilbur. Come on. Come on, Wilby. Come on, Wilbur. No, Petunia, it's Wilbur's. Come on. No, Petunia. Come on, Wilbur. Come on. Come on, Wilbur. Come on, Wilbur. Come on, goofball. Let's go. Back up, Petunia. Come on, Wilbur. Come on. Come on, Wilby. Come on, boy. Come on. Come on, Wilbur. Come on. No, Petunia, you can't have it. There you go, goofball. I'll give you some more, Petunia. Here, Petunia. Oops. All right. There you go, baby. Come on. There you go. Come on, Petunia. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on. Petunia, come on. Come on. What's wrong now that you don't want it? Come on, Petunia. Oh, there it goes. Don't you want it now? You ate the first piece good and Wilbur liked it. She don't want it. Look at there. What's wrong with you? You are about the goofiest looking pig with that dag blame tongue of yours, always at a curled position like you're sucking teeth. Anyway, he's going to go to the farmer's market tomorrow and take some of this abundance of stuff that just is ripening faster and we can get 
it taken care of. I'm gonna take it to the farmer's market and see if we can't make a little money. So I'll be out here all night probably picking. Come on, baby. You're such a good baby. Yeah, that's my fingers. That's my fingers, yeah. That's my fingers. She is a mean little rascal. Yeah. I ain't kidding you. I mean, she's she's friendly, but she's got she's got a mean streak in her, buddy. She <laughs> she she'll go down there and bite the goat's ears and and everything. And if they stick their head through there trying to eat something that she's got or something that I've thrown out to them, and maybe some of them bounced on the other side of the fence, and uh, they stick their head through the fence, and man, she'll bite their ears and she tears them up. Come on, hey, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hey, 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 what? What? Hey, that's my hand. That's my hand. What? 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 Oh. What? What? Huh? Uh, 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 what? What? Oh, you won't get it. Oh, you won't get it. Huh? Come on. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Uh, uh, uh. Come on, Violet. Come on, Violet. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. What, Violet? Oh, goodness. Knocked it out of my hand. Here you go, Violet. Here you go, Violet. Uh, uh, uh. Come on, Violet. Come on, Violet. Come on, Violet. Come on, baby. Let's go. Uh, come on. <laughs> you don't get it. I'm gonna get it. You dropped it. I'm gonna get it. You dropped it. I'm gonna get it. Come on, Vi. Come on. Come on, go. Don't drop it again. <laughs> Come on, Pigs are fun, man. Especially when they're little. You know, you won't get no better when they're little, man. They and they want to be around you and they want to be petted and played with and stuff it's fun once they get to wilbur's and petunia size they ain't really that much fun anymore and they just kind of pout and grunt and act like a bunch of bullies to one another and try to bully you if you got anything come on violet come on violet violet come on baby come on i got you i got you i got you one more yeah i got you one more Boy, my daddy would have loved you at the dad blame dinner table. <laughs> come on, come on, Vi. Come on, come on, you can do it. You can do it. Come on. Here you go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. All you gotta do is a little bit. Come on, get up there. Come on. Don't you bite me. Yeah, don't you bite me. <laughs> that's a good girl. That's a good girl, bye bye. Yeah, that's a good girl, baby. You sure are a pretty little thing. Yeah, you sure are pretty. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell y'all, we ate some of our peaches. Yeah, we ate some of our peaches. I ain't got no more, baby. That's my fingers, goofball. All right, you little fart. Yep. I'm gonna go. I gotta get some more stuff done. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow.
Oh, goodness. Anyhow, we ate a couple peaches. I think they might be white peaches, but I don't know. Hard to tell. And I got a couple big apples over there that uh, we might end up breaking a state record with. I don't know if it's the biggest apple I've ever grown. Of course, I ain't grown many apples. Grown some apples at uh, deep water on that tree and been trying to grow apples on this tree for, let's see, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, so five years now on this one. Anyways, you can see that apple right there. That's a big old apple. We'll see if it's big enough to do anything or not. Corn's looking good, everything's looking good. Everything's looking good. Everything's looking good. Oh my goodness. So. Oh boy. Uh, the one plant up there, the cucumber plant, it's busted up. Uh, it's not doing any good. So I'll show you that in a second. So uh, here is the one, and I meant to cover them up today. Oh, there's a good, oh, there it is right there. Anyhow, there's that one. Plant looks a lot better than the other one does. This one over here, I'm gonna leave it on there. I need to cover it up though before we go to the farmer's market in the morning, but uh, I mean, it's, it's solid. It's a solid. It's all a cucumber, you know. Um, looks good, but I don't know what's wrong. I don't know why the vine died. So, uh, it was sprayed with him at a clove root. And, uh, and bacteria and fungal stuff. So, I mean, there shouldn't be nothing wrong with it, but... There he is, and there might be a glimmer of hope down here on these tips here. I don't know, these two tips right here still looking okay, and they got blooms forming, so I'll just let it, I'll just let it do its thing and suck up as much as it can for as long as it can. All them beautiful sunflowers up there. They're pretty. Pretty, pretty, pretty. And there's one right here that we got to bloom. Let see. That's a teddy bear, what that's called. I'm, I think the other, the other one was a tall one, something giant, something. But uh, that one was a short one called a teddy bear, so it's pretty sunflower. But there, a bunch of them, we'll get them. Uh, took off the, the, um, plants tomorrow morning and put in some water and take them down there to uh, to the farmer's market and see if Kira can sell a few of them. And then uh, it got me a 9.65 right here. Rowan, I got this mega bloom right here. I don't know if that mega bloom right here is going to do any good or not, but this one right here may be the one. Plant just all of a sudden start turning off and getting bad again and uh, with that Satoria crap and uh, I had been keeping it on the porch moved it off the porch to get more sun over here and, uh, and it got worse so go figure but uh, anyhow uh, everything else is looking good try to get y'all better update tomorrow I've spent literally all day mending things fixing things you know uh, cutting pruning watering fertilizing things so uh you know i i'm i'm gassed out then i gotta spin go inside take a shower eat come back outside and start picking all these extra tomatoes and peppers and stuff that we got so we can haul it to the to the uh farmer's market in the morning and then after that, I get up about 4.35, probably about 4.30, 4, 4 o'clock or 4.30, really, because we need to be there about 
and I'm about to come out here and pick a bunch of Swiss chard and uh, and the sunflowers and stuff. So that'll take a little while, but uh, nevertheless, we'll we'll get it done and uh, take some stuff to the farmers market. And I'd rather sell it than go to waste trying to keep up with it. So at least selling it, we might be able to buy some more jars or stuff that we might need to go with it that I didn't get grown or something. So we'll see. Uh, hopefully this next coming week, we'll start planting our fall stuff. I'm gonna start prepping stuff for the fall, the squash patch. I'm gonna rip that last squash plant out of there and till it and amend it and plant it um, or amend it and maybe get ready for planting. We'll see which way it goes. We're definitely gonna have to plant a fall crop in there. Gonna prep the first corn patch and get it prepped and ready uh, for planting a fall crop. And then need to get in the greenhouse and start getting it cleared out and prepped and planted a few things in there. But a lot of what's gonna go in there is things that I wanna grow into like November, December that'll probably last in the greenhouse. So as long as it don't get too bad of a frost, right? I can keep it warm in there. We already figured that out. So hopefully I'll be able to keep it up, the temp up good enough, and we can you know keep tomatoes coming for you know at least uh, you know till then. I'd like to get a couple melons. Uh, we didn't get any watermelon this year, and I don't think we're going to get any watermelon this year, which is a bummer um, because I planted more watermelons, different varieties than I'd ever had before, and I even gave them a second go around, and don't think any of them did anything. Uh, cantaloupe same way and um, so next year we're going to swap that up next year uh, we will not plant uh, the cucumbers or any type of melon over there on that side we'll plant maybe uh, giant green squash over there you know or something to that effect but not any melon or cucumber cucumbers and melons will be up here behind me or down there where we have them at right now in front of the garden uh, which is right there by the long gore trellis. So uh, we'll, we'll move things around. And it's, it's, a, it's a figuring out game sometimes. And it just, the trellis is gonna have to be ripped up completely and just planted somewhere else. That's just a, like gonna have to be because uh, there's just, that, that trellis just ain't gonna do anything over there. I don't believe it dries out fast enough. Probably gonna have to put it like right here somewhere. I don't really wanna put it here somewhere, but Annie, you know, cause Annie ain't gonna want it here, but you know, probably gonna have to might have to run it that way, but whatever. So uh, that's that's for another date and another video. But uh, anyhow, guys, we uh, we appreciate you watching. We'll see you tomorrow right here in the hollers and hills of West Virginia. Don't forget to smash that like button, that notification bell. <laughs> Don't get this Good job. Here you go. Thank you. Don't forget that there. Don't forget to share. Yep. There you go. Good job. And, and subscribe. subscribe.